Hello there and welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to show you how to organize your favorites in Internet Explorer using folders. Now, you must have a few fold, um, favorites or bookmarks saved in your web browser before you do this. So you should have done learning activity 5 and added some favorites. Now we're going to do it. So, first thing you need to do is to move your mouse cursor and go and click on favorites. Once you click on favorites, go to organize favorites. And once you click on organize favorites, you will get a window open for you to organize it. Now I have two favorites here, BBC favorite page and BBC my favorite page. We're going to organize these favorites by putting them into a folder. So I'm going to go to new folder and I'm going to name my folder. Now remember the naming of the folder is very important because you must name, give the folder a name that reflects what you're putting in there. So if I'm putting in um, bookmarks of websites that have food recipes, I would probably name my folder my food recipes um, bookmarks or my food recipes um, favorites. So because I'm dealing with BBC favorite pages, I would just type in my, sorry about that. If this happens to you and you have something there, new folder, don't worry about it. Just click on the folder and go to rename and you can do it again. So I'll call it my BBC favorite pages. Or you could call it BBC favorite pages or pages on the BBC I always go to. It's entirely up to you. You decide. And then I've got my BBC favorite pages there. I'll simply click on my first BBC favorite page, click on move, and I'll move it to my BBC favorite pages, click on OK. Or I could simply just click and hold the page. So click this page, BBC favorite page, click it and hold, and then drag it into the folder. OK. And now if I click on my folder, I can see that two of the pages that were previously outside the folder are in the folder now. So I have organized my bookmarks by putting them in one particular folder. Okay. And then once you're done, just click on close. You now need to do this. You need to do it in a step-by-step -step format with explanations and paste it on your evidence report with screenshots. Now go and do it now. Thank you very much.